I am Dr. Satish Babu, Senior ENT Consultant working with the Apollo Hospitals, Bangalore. Yeah, tenderness uh, or pain around the ear, especially in front of the ear and uh, clicking sounds while open, the movement of jaw typically means that there is some issue happening in the temporomandibular joint. This can happen uh, at any point of life but uh, more so towards uh, later life where uh, you lose your teeth and the, and the jaw occlusion, the, the closure of the jaw becomes a little uh, changed, uh, the joint gets a little uh, worn off then there is a ch chance of developing these problems is quite more. But even otherwise, if there has been any dental issues or uh, some injury happened to the jaw joint or uh, jaw bone as such, mandible, then you have a chance to develop these things. If you had, even as simple as if you had bitten something hard, unknowingly, and the jaw gets uh, distracted um, forcefully, but like by, because of the biting force, then you may end up straining your joint temporomandibular joint. Like any other joint, this also will lead to pain, uh, movement restrictions and uh, tenderness around the joint. Uh, the ear block in these cases are rare but it does happen uh, you know when, whenever there is a tissue swelling around the uh, joint. Uh, the tissue swelling may also extend into the ear canal and thereby reducing the air entry or the sound entry into the ear and that could lead to a block sensation. Uh, and clicking in the temporomandibular joint only means that the cartilages are wearing off and that is a little more uh, significant than just a pain and uh, tenderness and jaw movement uh, restrictions. Uh, so uh, it shouldn't be taken lightly. Uh, it has to be evaluated by an ENT doctor or a maxillofacial uh, surgeon, dental surgeon. Uh, so that uh, remedial measures can be done to prevent any further uh, damage happening to the cartilage so the joint can be preserved and pain can be brought down uh, significantly. Uh, the basic management of this is if, if you've just had a few days of joint pain um, then, then you can just give rest to the uh, temporomandibular joint by having only soft diet, nothing hard to bite or chew, restricting the movements uh, of the jaw voluntarily. Uh, and pro applying some heat around the uh, joint region, right? Uh, so this will uh, reduce the pain and uh, inflammation. And going forward, if the pain persists, you can go for some anti-inflammatory painkillers with or without muscle relaxants. Um, you would probably need about a week or 10 days medication to bring the joint back to its normal uh, levels. Um, if not getting reduced to even by these, then you should consult a specialist and get these sorted out.